you want to learn what brands sell on eBay, watch this video to find out. What's up everyone, thanks for stopping in. Welcome to another thrifty new video. My name is Kevin. Uh, so today's just gonna be a quick haul video. Uh, stopped at a couple of thrift stores the other day, uh, one being Goodwill and the other being Salvation Army. And again, um, if you enjoyed this haul type content, don't forget, give us a thumbs up and hit the notification icon to let you know when we have some new content uploaded. And uh, of course, don't forget to check out some of the links down below, just some items we use on a daily basis to help us out selling on eBay. Um, so let's jump right into it and uh, we'll show you what we got. Uh, so, first up, some hard goods. Um, a little late for this, but... So we got a vintage strawberry shortcake light. Paid uh, $5 for this. And um, they were, all the comps were anywhere from 25 to 35. Um, so we'll probably um, ask for 35 and see what we get on that. And again, um, it wasn't half price or anything, um, so I'm going over the Goodwill stuff, it wasn't half price at Goodwill. Um, so everything you see, unfortunately, we did uh, pay full price for. Um, and so as you'll see, some of the stuff is a little pricey, uh, but unfortunately it's um, what we have to deal with uh, at the thrift stores in our area. Um, so this, we got a corduroy Levi's brown... Um, shirt jacket so Levi's and we paid uh, this wasn't too bad um, for what it is uh, so we paid eight dollars for this and this was anywhere um, they were about uh, 30 to 35 again for that so not too bad next we got some jeans so these are just some bread and butter type items um, when it comes to jeans um, so we sell this brand quite regularly. Um, so if that focuses, um, anyway, um, it's Buffalo, really good brand for us. Uh, these are a 3232 Evan Slim. And jeans, as you can see, when they're not half price, they cost us at Goodwill uh, nine bucks. Focus, focus. Nine dollars. And these, again, anywhere um, 30 35 for these buffaloes. Got another pair. Buffalo. Uh, these are the 6 6 model. Again, $9. And what do we got here? Uh, next, we got a few uh, button front shirts. So we got this one here. Nice plaid pattern. And this is a, this brand used to sell a little more regularly, uh, but Peter Millar. And so the shirts, button front shirts, as you can see, Again, when they're not half price, $8. And we'll get uh, mid to high 20s for this. Uh, so 25 to 30, we're looking at. And this particular brand, uh, we've mentioned it a few times for this one and this one here. Uh, we might lock them together if they're the same size. Uh, uh, they're a little different. Um, so it's a striped, multicolored. This brand does extremely well for us. Um, Eaton. This is a contemporary model. Again, eight dollars. Uh, but Eaton does really well for us. And depending on the style and the fit, um, we get thirty to forty uh, for this all day long. And again, this is Eaton as well. Uh, check pattern. Micro check pattern, I don't know. Yeah, check pattern. Again, it's eaten. And again, this was $8. 
and this one brown plaid this one's new with tags and that's the only reason we picked it up uh, so this is a Columbia generally we only pick up Columbia when it's the PFG model uh, this was eight dollars and MSRP on this was forty dollars um, so we'll probably put 30 on it and take a best offer and our last item for the Goodwill was these boots this is another decent brand that sells really well for us let's see if you'll be able to pick that up so we got Riker um, so these weren't too bad actually um, these are only seven dollars and um, we get these posted quick uh, with it still being that time of year for boots um, these are side zip the buckle on the side as well Riker does really well for us uh, so seven dollars uh, this should uh, shake out at about 40 for those um, so that was it for the, the uh, Goodwill not too bad uh, next up was uh, Salvation Army again it was a bunch of button up button front shirts that we picked up um, wasn't too much out there um, but we did only stop at two stores and um, didn't spend much time in there just went in and got out fairly quickly uh, so again button front shirt yellow plaid this is a decent Western brand uh, that sells fairly well for us if you're not familiar with it so cinch this does have some corporate branding on the cuff it's embroidered uh, shouldn't hurt the value too much see what it is as you can see uh, high pro feeds assuming it's some brand within the farming or Western community um, so again this was Salvation Army there was no sale um, actually um, there was no sale but we did have some $10 off coupons um, so I created two separate orders at the checkout um, so I could use each of the coupons and don't forget um, when you are going to the Salvation Armies and most thrift stores make sure you do bring a donation that way you do get some sort of discount card um, of some manner um, Salvation Army they give you $10 off when you spend $25 um, so yeah that works out well again cinch so this was $9.99 so $10 for a button-up but front shirt really well yeah it's a lot but uh, we should get probably um, $30 for this uh, that's on the high side realistically probably 25 uh, but they generally move pretty quick for us so um, yeah next this floral flower type pattern or yeah all over print blue uh, we don't pick this brand up too much unless it's a specific one that usually has the logo on the pocket this one doesn't but because of the model of it we still picked it up um, so this is Brooks Brothers red fleece really good quality um, when you feel it you can um, it's a heavy heavy cotton this is an XL again as you can see but front shirts at Salvation Army not that cheap in our neck of the woods so another $9.99 and this box pattern this one I haven't uh, picked up before um, it just when I touched it it felt like a good quality shirt so I looked it up I haven't sold this so we'll give it a shot see how well this sells um, 7 Downey Street so if this is something you've sourced and sold before, maybe leave a quick note down below. Let me know how it sells for you. Again, 7 Downey Street, same as the other button, button downs. This was $9.99, so $10. So we'll see how that one does. I haven't sold that one before. Uh, this picked up for myself, actually. Uh, maybe I'll look it up. I didn't really look it up, but it's Boss Selection by Hugo Boss. Just a standard purpley 
I don't know, purpley pink and colorblind, so I don't know, purple. Again, $9.99. Maybe I'll look this up, see what it goes for, but if not, the shirt for myself. Um, now this brand does, um, we haven't sourced it before, I haven't really found one yet, so this is the first one. Um, these do really well, they generally have some sort of crazy embroidered pattern on them. So, there you go, if you can guess just by looking at that, maybe shoot a little comment down below to guess what it is. So, Roar. Yeah. Uh, so we haven't found this brand before. This is the first one. Um, again, this was, whoa. So, made it a little better on this one. This was $6.99. So $7. And uh, the comps on this particular shirt, you're anywhere with $35 to $40. Uh, these sell pretty well uh, based on the comps. Uh, so we'll see what we get for that. And last but not least, we got a pair of these now they're not what you think they are um, so they're not Skechers I've actually not seen this particular brand but again um, these type of shoes are, are popular when it comes to the toning and fitness uh, people do like them especially the Skechers um, so the Skechers shape ups that's what these would look like but that's not what they are um, so these are Rin or Rhine, R-Y-N. I've never picked this particular brand up before, um, but again, looked it up and the comps were selling uh, pretty decent. Same pair in black, uh, sold for I think it was 130 uh, recently. Uh, so I'll probably put them up for probably 99 and see what happens. So these ones cost us 12.99, so 13 bucks. So that's it. Um, all in all, not too bad. Quick little uh, haul. Uh, just two thrift stores, mostly button front shirts, a couple pairs of shoes, and a hard good. Um, yeah, so not too bad. Um, so again, if you do enjoy this content, don't forget, give us a thumbs up. Hit the notification icon to let you know when we have some new content uploaded. And of course, check out some of the links down below. Just some items we use on a daily basis to help us out selling on eBay. Other than that, thanks for stopping in. Take care. Have a good one.